Incisional hernias can occur up to 30% of the time after a laparotomy happens to a patient. Um, and there's something that often when we go to do the initial operation, we don't talk to the patient about their risk for developing a hernia later. So it may be that years, months, sometime down the road, the patient starts to discover that something isn't quite right with their abdominal wall, but they may not be aware of what that thing is. And then subsequently, eventually they find out that it's a hernia, they may or may not need a repair for it. And of course, requiring a second operation can be a big deal in the quality of the life of the patient. Um, so I, I think it's something that's insidious, it's something that we perhaps don't pay a lot of attention to and don't consider upfront at the time of an operation. It is really a groundbreaking type of concept that we may be able to prevent one of the most common surgical problems that occurs in the United States annually.